Are you getting enough social interaction at work at the moment? Now I'm specifically talking to people who are doing a lot more virtual stuff, online stuff, and they're not getting the same amount of social interaction and the water cooler talk that they're used to having. So if that's you, this video is for you. Hello everyone, my name is Annalie, and today I wanna to talk about the number one barrier to preventing us from having more social interactions when in an online environment. To me, this is a really interesting topic. There's something going on that prevents us from just picking up the phone and inviting someone to have coffee with us or booking a video call to say, hey, I'm on my tea break. Will you have a tea break with me? And what I've noticed is it's about permission. And this is where I think leaders have a really important role to play. A lot of my clients are reporting that they feel under pressure to work all the time if they're working from home. And of course, I get that. You want to make sure that if you're out of sight, you're not out of mind, that your boss and the people around you know you're still engaged and know you're still able to deliver. But is it okay for you to take 20 minutes off? Is it okay for you just to call a friend and go for a walk around the block? I mean, of course the answer is yes, just in case you weren't sure. The answer is yes. We need to be able to have punctuated moments in our day and in our week where we take breaks. But there is this feeling, if you're working from home, like you have to constantly be working. So this is where leaders have a really important part to play. As a leader, you can be setting the tone to say, it's okay to call up somebody and just go for a coffee. It's okay if I call you and say, hey, do you wanna grab a coffee? Leaders set the tone for what's okay and what's not okay. So if you are a leader watching this, then I strongly recommend you say something about this or you set a precedent around this by reaching out to people or let people know that you support this action and not only support it, that you think it's vital to their mental health and well-being. Social connections are crucial to productivity, to mental health, to solid relationships. And if you're not a leader, but you know you still wanna do this, then just do it. You'd be surprised how many people are willing to take your call and willing to join you in your morning tea break. So do everybody a favor and just reach out. Thanks.